Yo, what's up guys, uh, Jason's here, and um, uh, I uploaded the uh, Travis Scott Fortnite figure yesterday, and um, I got some complaints that you guys actually wanted to see them kissing, not really complaints, but you guys wanted to see the Travis Scott figures kissing, um, I totally forgot about this, I'm sorry, I should have done it the first second I got these figures, I don't know what I was thinking, um, so... Yo, this is a big moment. This is a big moment in history. We got Sickle Mode, which I feel like is Drake. Um, and we got Travis Scott. They're about to have a first case. It is crazy. This is crazy. Yo, here, yo. Yo, they kissed. They kissed. There you guys go. They kissed. Uh, I know some of y'all, for real, for real, wants to see uh, how the... the um, like the quality of the figure, honestly, this it's okay. It's okay. It's like a figure that you would pay like thirty dollars for uh, or twenty bucks. Like it's not cheap, cheap where you feel like you barely grab it and it's gonna break or like it's gonna fall apart. Like it definitely puts some quality into it, but it's definitely not like the old rodeo one. So um, you know, for seventy five dollars for both figures, I mean, I think it was a okay deal. Um, and I mean, you got the little accessories and the nice little details of the glow up sickle mode, but you know, it's pretty cool. I, I dig it. I like it. Um, but anyways, beside the Fortnite figures today, we are actually going to be, um, creating some Cactus Shack merch. It's illegal to sell, but not illegal to make. Um, so here I made these, um, these little, des well, I didn't make these designs. My friend Sebastian made these. Um, and here we have the, this Cactus Jack logo I made it myself, and these are just the other ones, you know, that he printed out. So I could print them on shirts, um, like this one right here. Kind of try to do it. This is just on a golden tee. I pretty much what Travis Scott uses for his t shirts. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna just put Cactus Jack on here. I mean, something simple, but I feel like it's gonna look fire. Definitely the blue and the brown with this one will look really nice. So, um, I'm gonna just, you know, teach y'all how to do it. I don't have a vinyl cutter, which is what you need to do this whole process. Um, you could Google that up and, you know, just try to figure it out yourself. Um, but I was just trying to show you how to apply it or how the final result looks. I also got some franchise merch coming in, so I'm going to be making a video about that. Pretty excited. Um, franchise was a freaking... I loved it. It's such a good song. I loved it. Um, and, uh, yeah, let's get started. And we're going to try out the first one on the black t-shirt. And we're going to use the uh, Cactus Shack. Uh, the white one, actually. And um, so this is the way I'm going to do it. I'm just going to iron out or I'm going to be putting the cactus jack um, just in case and my friend just said to peel it off and just put it back on and it should be good to go so we're gonna see yo I'm kinda scared though Alright, and supposedly we're supposed to put some cloth over it and let it heat around like 15 seconds. So I don't know, I should double layer it. I don't know, I feel like it's gonna be fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then I said 15 minutes, I meant to say like 15, 20 seconds. Um, I think this should be alright. Okay, this seems kind of melted, and then we're gonna flip it around and do the 
this same over here. I feel like it, it, it needed a little bit more time, but that actually came out pretty nice. Definitely have to iron a little bit more, um, but I'm gonna double double this up. Yep. Yep. And my white tee. That actually looks super nice. I'm not gonna lie. That looks beautiful. Honestly, I would rather invest into a vinyl cutting machine and, you know, do these little Cactus Jack logos on it. And there you go. It's uh, your custom made Cactus Jack t shirt, which this shirt was like $2.99 at Hobby Lobby. And then the decal, I got it from my friend for five bucks. So in total, I spent less than ten dollars to make a cactus shack shirt that the man Travis Scott would sell for like thirty dollars for. Um, definitely, definitely a big up. All right, guys. So that was a success. Um, as you can see, I got the cactus jack on here. Um, it turned out pretty well. Now it's time to do the custom logo that I made, which is this one right here. Hey, we're gonna stick this one on here. It doesn't wanna stop. pretty live and then maybe on the back I uh, put the brown one. Yes. I don't know how it's gonna stick, but let's hope it does soon. Alright yeah so my other camera just died and so now we're on the GoPro but in conclusion, I finished the second tee, and the second tee came out to be pretty nice. Here's the Cactus Jack, um, the custom one I made, and then on the back, I decided to put the uh, little face on it. I don't know. Yeah, that was kind of off, I'm not going to lie. I put it, uh, I should have centered it a little bit more. But, um, I mean, it still looks pretty nice. I like it. I like the Cactus Jack thing too. It looks pretty clean. I'm definitely gonna do it in other clothes for sure. Um, but yeah, if you guys wanna try this out, you know, uh, find you a buddy who um, has a vinyl cutter or, you know, go to a shop or something. Um, get you some Gildan t-shirts and just iron it on and you'll got yourself some homemade Cactus Jack shirts or maybe you think you could do better, um, you know, get creative with it, you know. Creativity is a key to success. Um, so yeah, guys. Um, with that being said, uh, if you guys want to see more videos like this, uh, more how-tos, I have a whole bunch of things I make. And also, I got a franchise video coming out soon. Travis Scott, Sickle Mode, you feel me? Uh, with that being said, uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace.